Let's look at a map and see how far away we are from where we need to be. Fucking miles. Okay. So now we'll do our part two of episode three. Raymond. That's you, isn't it? <laughs> the BSAA. A little too late. What is the FBC doing here? <laughs> answer me, Raymond. I don't have to answer anything. It's... You have no authority over this. There's no time to fight. We've got to... Give it a rest. I don't even know why you're here or who you're fighting. Raymond, stop right there! Nothing will change unless you get your hands dirty. So the FBC is on this ship too. What's going on here? We're operating without any intel. We need to search this ship for answers. Not that I relish the idea. Ooh, relish. Makes me hungry. I, I didn't think that when that whole confrontation started that it would just end with one of them walking off, but there you go. Okay, I think we looked up here and there wasn't really anything. Yeah, okay, let's head down back into the bowels with our good buddy Parker. What weapons we got? We got... Oh, we literally just have a handgun. That kind of sucks. If they can somehow keep complementing, like, half a mission here on the ship with half a mission somewhere else, like, could we have, oh, there you go. Could we have, like, the snow, and then we have that Terra Grigia mission. Like, I love that shit. It's like, this can be like the kind of the base one, you know what I mean? And you kind of like offshoots in like other places, which I kind of love so far. <gasps> the helm key. Oh, helm is like the steering wheel, apparently. Okay, so that's probably the same card reader thing that needs the, uh, like in that other room we found. More custom parts. Is that it? Yeah. I wonder if that door at the end of the hall is a helm door. It is, okay. We should find an emergency communication room if we go through the hall. So we can pick up maps, apparently. Oh. Okay. Oh god, please help me. This can't be happening. Don't leave me to die in this hell. I'm trapped here. There are monsters here. Real ones. Everyone's dead or dying. There are no survivors. Shit, we're all gonna die. Oh, we have a guy in a chair. That'll be the thing that we have to put into... I can't remember where it was, but there was like a thing that had a hole in it. And I guess that'll be what we have to put in. Let's see what happens here. Oh, it's Maggot Mouth. Is he going to get up? Okay, I guess we have to stick our hand in his... cavity. Zombie... Oh, Queen Zenobia, not zombie. So just random shit. The Paraguas line flagship was constructed in 1978. Okay, interior designed to replicate that of ships in the 1930s. Okay, so that's why it's so fancy. Zenobia, after the queen of the Palmyrene Empire, deposed by the Romans. Known as the Beauty of the Atlantic. With the rise of air travel, it was destined to be junked in the late 80s, purchased by the Paraguas line, and her steam turbines were replaced with electric diesel propulsion system. And then she was expanded and then turned into a fully functional luxury liner. 
After it was restored, we went around different places. So that was done in 1995, so it's been around a while. Okay, let's stick our hand in. Or not, okay. He'll probably come back. And that'll be like the intro of just like normal zombies, maybe. Oh, can we scan him? Ah, there you go. I knew... Oh, okay, I thought it was going to be more elaborate than that, but no. Okay, so we have loads of shells for the shotgun, which we don't have. We should go to the emergency communication room. Maybe try to contact HQ. Well, where is that, Parker? I love how it has auto-saving. You have no idea how much I love that. Okay, I'm guessing go back up again. We got to find Raymond. How do you know him? I used to work with him. Let's leave it at that. Can we turn that? Probably not. Thought it would have been fun. Okay, through we go. I swear he didn't even like move there, he just like kind of which to being in a different position. That was cheating. Okay, I wonder if this, like if you look at lockers in one, if it like stays empty for the next one, if you take something out of it. Okay, now, okay, that makes sense. Uh, okay, we can go to the upper cabins because there was doors there. Have we been here? We have been here. Okay, I guess we went more around than I thought we did. Okay, note from 303. What the hell's going on? Monsters are crawling all over the ship. They're tearing it to pieces. I've never seen monsters like this. Their movements are stiff, stilted, but it's all over if they get a hold of you. Those piece of shit monsters ate my husband, my friend Hassan, bastards. I used my gun to frighten them off, giving me time to get the hell out of there. The bullet went straight through its arm. These monsters have bones like an old woman. There's nowhere left to run now. Damn, monster twisted my leg good. Hell, I've run out of ammo too. God only knows how long I'm going to survive this. Yes, these brittle boned old woman monsters. Is that it? No, that can't be it. One like journal thing. Anything to scan at least. Illegal. I don't think the uh, police are going to be breaking down, like, the fucking container doors at any point. You got contraband. We just wasted stuff because there's nothing really in here. Okay, this is more like it. Ah, I got out. And they can't follow us. I do like that. So obviously Resident Evil 2 used to like chase us round, whereas this one it's just like, eh, I can't use doors. Okay, is this where the, the foyer thing is now? Yes, it is. Oh! Oh! 
I thought it kind of looked like it was going to like shoot something at us. I don't like these ones. Oh, there's another one. If, ugh, fuck, this is awkward. Bloody banister. We're in the wrong place. Just fucking unloading into this fucker. Okay, here... Is this where the circle thing was now? Use the helm key. Oh! No, can't do that yet. <gasps> wow! Call a cruise ship. It's like an opera house in here. Can we look at these? Is there anything behind this? No, that's disappointing. Okay, so maybe we just might be like lower down. Okay, we're going up. The solarium. I don't know why they made these doors so long. I think unreasonably long. It's like, what, 10 plus seconds? Is that gonna be one of them guys that shoots things? Where's Parker? There he is. Okay, maybe that's like a cocoon. We can't get it till it comes down. Oh. What is this place? Two percent, you can me. Oh, there you go, that'll bring it up. They're like gremlins. Do we still have that screwdriver? Yeah, we do. Okay, so... Let's see how this goes. Oh, and you can only move like one at a time. Okay, pretty simple. Yeah, that one there, and then that one up. All good. Yes. Activate the purifying apparatus? Okay. Filtration's gonna take a while. Should've known. I'll come back late. <laughs> okay, cool. So it's like leaving it open to something that will come back to you later. That's pretty cool, actually. 
I don't know whether it'll be in like this chapter, it might even be in like another chapter. This bloody tank is massive. We're on like the third of 12. And we have all these different places to explore. Because they're keeping it fresh with like the, the decor, I guess. Okay, it's not working. Because I was worried with having like an old rusty boat that it was just going to get like pretty, you know, boring. But actually it's not too bad. Okay, let's try and actually get to what we want to be doing. Which would probably be just go down the stairs like they want us to. Okay, so we know that's not working. Okay, down behind here, or is this going to be cut off by an anchor? Yeah. Casino sounds like it could be an interesting area. Okay, what are we going to do? Oh, actually, that wasn't where we came in, was it? So let's go this way. Promenade. We do want to go to the communications room, but... Whatever. Okay, let me change batteries real quick, hang on. Okay, hey, we're back with new set of batteries, so we should be all good to go. Pretty useful, actually, you gave me a chance to go and get a toilet break as well, so all in favor for that. So sorry about that, but here we go. Really cool looking area, look at that. Okay, I guess we have to go right here. Actually, I'll check, check the map and see if... We're going the right direction. I think so? Yeah, it looks like it. Change weapon. Uh, does that mean that we have to drop this one? See, I knew I shouldn't. Why did I take so many fucking guns? When you change your weapon, it will automatically be available for retrieval from any weapon box. Weapon box locations are displayed on the map. That's really nice of them. Fuck them. Oh shit! <laughs> that was cool. I'm flying. Okay, we, we have too much health. Wow, one shot with that rifle. Corner. We have yet to find one survivor. Look at this, it's like a 
I've just watched series two of Kidding. And this isn't like a spoiler. This is like a thing that happens, but there's like an area where they have um, like a little old fake town. And uh, it like reminds me of this. It's like Le Palais de Gourmand, whatever that means. Uh, it's like people with like dementia and stuff can go there. Okay, we don't have the, the, the life ring key. Um, and like pretend to live out like whatever thing they're doing or something. Uh, but I think it's just like a mall with shops, but it reminded me of that. You are dead thing reminds me of um, Resident Evil 4. Okay, first death in episode 3, that's not bad, I guess. Continue, yes, of course, continue. Okay, they're gonna be an annoying pain in the ass. Worth trying it again. Okay, let, yeah, I want to see what's in this room. So, This evade thing is not working. Okay, let's have a look in this room. Okay, hang on, we'll read this in a bit. Okay, maybe that thing can't die. Okay, yeah, I, I, I was going to say, I don't think we can kill this one. Let's read this journal thing then. And then we'll try and run out somehow. Made the right decision coming to the promenade. I've got food and beverages to last me a long time. I can still hear those things out there clawing on my door or looking for prey. Too bad they ain't getting in here. I have no idea if anyone else is still alive, but I know that I'm going to make it through this all right. Those damn things got in through the air ducts, but I put them all down before they could do any damage. I've trained for this, and I trained hard. Hats off to me. Good thing I was up. When it happened, no more deep sleeps for me. After yesterday's surprise party, I haven't been able to sleep a wink. My nerves are frayed, pretty tired. Conserve energy, got a fever, big lump, and it hurts. I found someone to talk to, so happy. He's very funny, tells lots of jokes, lots of funny. I laugh, laugh. His face is too close, in my face. He thinks so too, no room to move, had a fight, he wanted all the food, he was eating meat, good tasty meat, I saw his face, chewing, eating, no meat for me, looked tasty, 
His head looked tasty. Help, can't move, trap, me, not me. Who is me? Help, please. Mayday, 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 mayday! Okay, let's go. Fuck, what the fuck? Where did this, how did this happen? Can we jump down? Okay, we need to find that key. It's so stupid, we can't run. Mm -hmm. Unless we can, I just haven't worked out yet. Take us back up with them. Exit. Anything out here if we can move quickly? Nothing that much of use. It's not like he said, I need calm. What the fuck did you just say? Whoa. Oh, he's running like... Oh no, no, we had him! down not into him oh my god oh my god okay I'm, I'm my guess is that we just have to like lure him into like every that's cool he like went down and he's still crawling that's cool can we even kill these or do we have to Where the hell did this mission come from? It's been like... Simple. Can we call for these or... Okay, let's not go for that one.
Okay, there's one more up here, so if we can... Try and be quick. And then when he comes through here, shoot him. No, you want to go that way. Wow, we've done 150 already. No! Oh my god. Oh my god, we did it. That was insane. That time it wasn't as spectacular as when we headshotted it on that thing before. Look at this. Look at that, like, flat blood coming up the stairs. Holy shit. I am really happy that we did that because... Fuck. Is this more... Is this shotgun or rifle? Okay, shotgun. Alright, let's go up and... Uh, I don't really know what. Because our other guns just use this ammo as well, don't they? So... Oh boy! Okay, well it's saved, so I guess let's just go through that. <coughs> thing here. Oh. Well, that was good. Holy shit, that was hard. Like, what? Oh my god, we're in level three. And they just fucking throw that on you for no reason. Why? Why? That was horrible. You gotta think that might be the end of this section, maybe? Okay, won't be working, let's- okay, yeah. I saw it as soon as I, like, went to interact with it. Wow, I cannot go over that, that was insane. I thought I was doing something wrong, like, I was like, oh. Alright, so... That was simple. I thought I had it, but then I was like, that can't be it, because that's like too easy. So I wonder if that's like a one-off like kind of boss thing. Like a mini boss, or whether we're actually gonna... That's like an enemy type. Uh, do we want the bridge or the deck? 
What do we want? Try bridge. Whew. I don't know what to say now after that. That was fuck. Oh yeah, we've been here, so we want to go to the deck apparently. I think, I don't know. Okay, yeah, this looks, yeah, this is a new area, pretty sure. Oh, another handprint. Okay, what's in this box? Okay, so because it's a box, it's like more ammo. Okay, okay, hopefully it knew that we were going to expend loads there, which is why it's giving it to us. Magnum. Okay, so we're going to get the Magnum at some point, which if the other game is anything to go off, that's like pretty good. I don't know if it'll be like a one-hit kill, but... Ah, okay, we need another card thing. I guess we don't have any choice but to go through here. Although, we need the card reader, so how do we do this then? Another door over here, but same thing. Let's look at our map and see how far away we are from where we need to be. Fucking miles, okay. So we want to be in the hall. So let's look, promenade deck. So you want to be in the upper cabins and then that way we can get through to the cafeteria, in which it looks like we've got to go through that to get to there, or actually, we could go through the promenade deck. Okay, and we have access to that via the lift, so let's do the promenade deck. So maybe we did this like too early. I don't know. But at least it's done now. So it's kind of like linear, yet you can kind of explore and go in like other directions. It's kind of weird how they've set it up. Okay, so we can't go out there. Oh, because we came in through... We came in through that door. Okay, maybe it's something to do with this. We can go back through this shop here. So basically you just need to go to the second floor and there's a, a thing there, essentially. Is that a box? Well, that was nicer then. Okay, so I guess we did have to go that way and then come back through, that makes sense.
Raymond! Looks like we both were too late. What are you talking about? Huh. Ignorant creatures who do not yet know of us. The time both of you. Has come. Look. Thou wilt that I renew. The desperate greed drains my heart already. Little masked friend. But if my words be seed that may bear fruit of infamy to the traitor whom I know, speaking and weeping shalt thou see together. I know not who thou art, nor by what mode thou hast come down here. The world is in our hands. This is the tea of this virus, and we are equipped to infect one-fifth of the Earth's waters. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Abandon hope? He's quoting Dante. Send a team to Valcoin and Mach Airport. Look for something linked to this ship, O'Brien. Yes, I read you. I'll send Quint and Keith. What? You two, get ready to move. Uh, I hate Snow. <laughs> snow hates you. Just find out anything you can on Veltro. ship at sea is like finding a needle in a haystack. No kidding. But that still doesn't solve our problem. Hey, are you even listening? We'll find you, Jill. I promise. Hallelujah. Okay. Ghost of Ultra, complete. Episode 3. What I'm going to do is, I'm probably going to have split that into two parts since that second one on its own was a fucking nightmare. There you go, achievement cleared episodes 1 to 3. Let's have a look at our thingy scores. An hour for that. I still got an A even though I totally fucked it up. Okay, that's cool. They give you like shit for doing certain boundaries. Okay, so yeah, there you go. That was uh, chapter three, Ghosts of Veltro. Oh boy, that was a fucking journey. Um, they kind of ruined it now that we know that it's like fucking Santa that we have to fight. Yeah, so thanks for watching, stay awesome, and I'll see you guys next time for part four, where we hopefully, maybe, as Chris and Jessica, find Jill and Parker. And I must say, Jessica has some excellent choice in outfits. I'm not sure if it really fits the environment that she's in, but I'll take it. But yeah, that being said, it's kind of interesting how you can explore some areas that I'm assuming we're going to get to later, or that'll come into play later, like when we had the the swimming pool with like the kind of gremlin things in it, and you could kind of sort that thing out now, as opposed to maybe later when we all go back there, you'd think. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see how it all plays out, and it looks like the main area we're going to be staying on for like the whole game is going to be this ship, but I'll, I guess we'll see how it carries on. So that's kind of interesting that it's all on like one big container ship. So, well not container ship, cruise ship, whatever. Okay, but yeah, I've waffled on enough. Uh, that was fun, but like stressful as fuck. Like that bit running around, I guess, next time we get into a boss, just kind of attack, attack, attack until they're dead. Uh, rip and tear until it is done, as some would say. Yeah, boy, fuck, that was hard, okay. So yeah, glad to make it through, but that being said, 
thanks for watching stay awesome and hopefully you'll join me next time for part four where we find jill so yeah thanks guys